Neuropedia and my this news is uh, uh, news of concern actually because uh, this year placements in IIT campuses are very less uh, compared to last year and this trend is going to be observed for one more year as per our understanding because of global and national economic recession. These are uh, across all IITs if I talk about and when I say IIT it includes other institutes also the situation is not better. MTech placements are only 25%. There may be some departments where placements are more, there may be some departments where less but on an average what we can conclude is 25%. The source of information of this data are various sources. The first hand source are our own students who are from IITs and we keep on getting the information from them. So on an average they say 25%. And other sources are newspaper reading, newspaper uh, you know articles and newspaper news and all. You must have seen that on your own also. So this year it is quite less. And those Jinka 25% placement offer who have job offer who have Kitani companies unko wo job uh, offer pay join karvayenge or unko reject ni karvayenge unka offer that also is not very clear because it so happens that aapko agar suppose agar September ka joining mila hai later on company can decline it and a regret letter can be sent by the company to you. So that means job placement option bhoot achhi nahi hai. Ab aise time pay students ko kya karna chahiye masters wale students ko kya karna chahiye uh, normally friends Whenever economic recession hits and placements are less, I am talking about master's students first. And same is the strategy for B.Tech students also. B.Tech mein agar IITs ka baat dekha jaye, to mere ko lagta hai placement 45% ke aspas hai, jo mere ko samaj jata hai. So 25% and 45% and the reason is, B.Tech students get assimilated in many generic jobs. Wo banking ka job, finance ka job, marketing ka jobs, बहुत के जॉब्स में वो एसिमिलेट हो जाते हैं तो इनका प्लेसमेंट कंपैरेटिवली थोड़ा ज्यादा है नाउ व्हाट कैन बी डन रिसेशन के टाइम पे एक नेचुरल जो ऑप्शन स्टूडेंट्स एक्सप्लोर करते हैं वो हायर एजुकेशन का होता है एक ऑप्शन हायर एजुकेशन का एक ऑप्शन नेचुरल होता है और हायर एजुकेशन के भी हमारे पास दो ऑप्शन आते हैं एक हायर एजुकेशन इंडिया में और एक हायर एजुकेशन अब्रॉड में now if I am not getting placement in M.Tech, so I should join Ph.D. in the same department, same IIT. But the question is, are you joining Ph.D. out of your interest or because you are not getting jobs, so you are doing Ph.D. The second thing is not good. Why? Because you do not have interest in further research, but still you join Ph.D. So you will not be satisfied. Now, why not you people go for Ph.D. jobs? Now, Ph.D. jobs is different from Ph.D. Try to understand friends, what are PhD jobs and both B.Tech and M.Tech students can go for that. B.Tech as well as M.Tech students can go for that. In my opinion, this is a wonderful option for you, opportunity for you. All those students who are not getting placement, this can be a good option. Now, PhD jobs means when the PhD as a program is advertised as a job. You are employee of the organization institute, you are not a student. Suppose you are doing PhD in IIT Bombay, you are not employee of IIT Bombay, you are student of IIT Bombay. But think of some university in European country. If suppose there is some university in Sweden and if you are doing PhD there, you are not a student, you are employee of that university. And you must have seen that in numerous my videos where a student gets a PhD opportunity in the university and he is telling that I am getting a salary and I am employee. And every year there is a, you know, the allowances of the employees are given, benefits of the employees are given. So when you are in PhD job, this actually is a project which is funded by industry. So the professor is doing the project of industry and for doing that project he needs to hire the employee. What we here in India see as research assistant like JRF. SRF, you must have uh, listened to these terms, junior research fellow, senior research fellow, there is a kind of employee in that project. Similar to that, professor is uh, doing the industry project and the money he is getting from industry, out of that money he is giving you scholarship. 
the professor is giving scholarship to PhD in writing. Now suppose professor is to hire one engineer, then he is to give him five thousand dollars to hire one engineer for the, doing some project. But in terms of PhD, he can give only twenty five hundred dollars, and he can have a PhD. The PhD student can be B Tech to PhD, it can be M Tech to PhD, so he will get employee at twenty five hundred dollars. And he will employ him for three to four years. So after B Tech, it will take him four years. After M Tech, it will take him three years. So the professor is hiring you as employee for three to four years. Now, when the professor is hiring you for three to four years, you are working on a project of industry. And once you complete that project in timely manner, there is a very high probability you will get the job in the same industry. So friends, आप में से जो B Tech का student और जो एम का स्टूडेंट पीएचडी जॉब्स में इंटरेस्टेड है अब इसमें सबसे अच्छी बात यह है कि आप इमीडिएटली आफ्टर बीटेक और एमटेक दोज ऑफ यू हु वांट टू अर्न मनी एंड गिव द मनी बैक टू होम उनके लिए बेस्ट है बिकॉज इंटरनेशनल स्केल के ऊपर 1500 डॉलर में आपका खर्चा निकल जाता है और जब मैं ये डॉलर में लिख रहा हूं तो मनिटरी टाइम मनिटरी वाइज इट इज सेम फॉर वेन आई कंपेयर इट इन यूरो और आई कंपेयर इट इन यू नो Uh, in corona in uh, sweden and all in scandinavian countries or i compare it with the dollar of singapore or australia or you know for that matter in england i am comparing it in pounds or something so it is internationally same that means aapka sara kharcha isme nikal jayega in any in any case you will be saving monthly 50000 to 1 lakh monthly you will be saving in these jobs and you can send back home that money so if you are jobless if you do not have job and if you are looking for immediate settlement so that next 2 3 years of recession you can you know cover it up and you can uh, smoothly pass through this phase of recession and at the same time you don't compromise with your career friends a best opportunity hai ab aap mein se jo bhi aise student jo isko explore karna chahte hain let me tell you what credentials do we want what credential you should have for पीएचडी जॉब्स अगर आप पीएचडी जॉब्स के लिए जाना चाहते हैं बाहर तो क्या क्रेडेंशियल है नंबर वन आपका सी जी पी ए शुड बी सेवन प्लस फॉर टी एर वन कॉलेजेस टी एर वन कॉलेज में आपका आई आई टी वगैरह आता है एन आई टीज आते हैं और ऐसे बहुत सी सेंट्रल यूनिवर्सिटीज वगैरह आती है तो मेरे को लगता है सारे के सारा उस लीग में आ जाएगा अदरवाइज सेवन पॉइंट फाइव प्लस इफ यू आर टी एर टू और टी एर थ्री कॉलेजेस ये सी जी पी ए की रिक्वायरमेंट है नंबर टू आपका प्रोजेक्ट अच्छा होना चाहिए यू मस्ट हैव डन अ गुड प्रोजेक्ट इज द सेकंड क्राइटेरिया ओनली दीज टू क्राइटेरिया एंड देन यू अप्रोच द मेंटर्स ऑफ योर पीडिया यू हैव अ फ्री सेशन विद देम दे विल टेल यू मेनी मोर थिंग्स इफ दैट हिट्स यू यू कैन स्टार्ट योर प्रोसेस हाउ मच टाइम इट विल टेक फॉर यू टू गेट अ फर्स्ट कन्वर्शन तो मेरे को लगता है आपको सिक्स मंथ्स मैक्सिमम जिसमें अगर आप अभी से फाइट करना स्टार्ट करते हैं यू स्टार्ट पुटिंग द एफर्ट नाउ आपको जीआर नहीं लगाना एल्स विल बी सफिशिएंट अभी से अगर एफर्ट करना स्टार्ट करते हैं तो छह मंथ के अंदर आपके पास ऐसी ऑप्शंस आना स्टार्ट होंगी अच्छी यूनिवर्सिटी अच्छी ग्लोबल यूनिवर्सिटीज की और एक और बात याद रखना ओनली गुड यूनिवर्सिटीज कैन गिव यू स्कॉलरशिप समथिंग लाइक इंडिया मास्टर्स में और पी में स्कॉलरशिप ओनली अच्छी यूनिवर्सिटीज दे, दे पाती है other universities cannot give you scholarship so if you uh, basically want to go with scholarship after btech to direct phd after mtech to phd if you want to get good scholarship then only good universities will give you that and as you know your pdia only mentors you for good universities so agar aapka cgp acha hai aur agar aapka project acha kiya hai then you will get it the rest mentors of your pdia will do it those of you who are graduate from tier 1 colleges and their cgp is 8 plus they have very high probability of getting selected and they should surely explore these options so friends agar aapka uh, thoda sa inclination is tarah hai ki mere ko job leni hai abroad mein leni hai mere ko achhi scholarship leni hai fully funded phd ya ms program lena hai you can do that many times student will say that sir i am a btech but i do not want to go for phd i do not want to do phd because phd is a long commitment and is a long course and here is a catch friends PhD may be 4.5 to 5 years for you, but after two years you can convert your PhD into MS program, and at the same time you can get a good scholarship. You join PhD, and you got a good scholarship. You got 2,500 dollars. 
after two years you decided that you want to convert your PhD into MS and you want to discontinue now. So you can take MS after two years. They will not ask you for the scholarship back. But maybe after MS you got a good job and then you went there. Foreign universities may be a normal trend. Hai. India may not. India may the moment you join direct PhD, you can do PhD or you can't do anything. Abroad may not. Abroad may you can convert your PhD into MS and you can take MS and go. So friends, if you want to invest in B-Tech, you don't want to invest in B-Tech, you don't want to go with a scholarship, then this is the way you can do that. And your PDA is basically champion in that, mentors of your PDA are champion in that, they will help you to do that. So friends, recessionary phase is going on and this is the best time to go for higher education. If you have not been in your placement, if you have not been in your placement, but you want to explore the opportunity, who knows in the further recession, even those who have got the job, they may get laid off. So, you have such opportunities so that you can go there. Because you will have 5-6 months to explore the opportunity. So, start your process now so that you can convert these into global selections where you get the scholarship. All the very best friends. Look forward to mentor you. And as many interested students have a Google form, so that we can convert it to your mentor session with your mentor. and then you can start your process. All the very best, thank you.